Stranger Things has a fan base of billions and for good reason. The previous season had us sitting on the edge during each episode, and if you're like us, we bet you can't wait for season 5. Keep on watching, because here's everything we know about the upcoming season. Release Date You'll be glad to know that Netflix has already announced and officially commissioned the fifth and final season of Stranger Things. The creators of the show said that they always believe the show would last for four to five seasons. Otherwise, it would feel a bit dragged out. And they've stuck to their word, keeping in mind that the pace of the storyline is smooth. If there is one thing we're not sure about, though, is the exact date when the new season is going to be released. It hasn't been confirmed yet, but sooner or later, the show that aired back in 2016 will be coming to an end. The Plot The ending of Volume 2 of Season 4 certainly left people with a lot of questions. In the ending scene, we can see that Hawkins and the Upside Down submerges into one plane. We won't be wrong to predict a war between the two worlds in the near future, though, and that's probably what the main focus of the story is going to be on, the Battle of Hawkins. As we know, that in the last season, Max died for a whole minute, and that was surely enough time for the gateway that Vecna needed to open. It was equivalent to the final crack in the dam that was mentioned earlier in the show. What this means is that there was now a split between the Upside Down and the reality. This allowed the Upside Down to seep into the real world, and slowly the two worlds would be merged into one. In the episode, when Vecna was burnt by Nancy and Robin, he stated to Eleven how he wanted to rebuild the world into something way better than it already was, and he was not going to stop unless he gotten everybody who stood in his way. With Vecna's human form being destroyed, and him being able to transcend his physical self in the form of darkness in Mind Flayer and the Shadow Monster, we can say that this is the beginning of the end. He would undoubtedly be able to wreak havoc on the entire world. With an army of Demogorgons and other creatures, things would become far worse before they start to get better. Will One thing is for sure though, Vecna is going to come back and attack with all of his power that's left, and in a really short amount of time. Will may play a significant role in this upcoming season as he's the only one, besides Eleven, who's able to sense the presence of the Mind Flayer, no matter how much the distance between the two are. He is the one character that has had a personal connection with the Flayer since Season 1. In one of the final shots of Season 4, Will was the focal point of the scene where he touched the back of his neck and realized that the Mind Flayer is back and more powerful than before. This shows us that the two of them are still connected and there are elements of the shadow monster that are still within him. Max Another character that might play a very significant role in the next season is Max. In the final scenes of season 4, we saw that Max was still unconscious, in a state of a coma, and Lucas stated that the chances of her even waking up again are very slight. Eleven tried to enter her mind, but saw that there was nothing there. This was an experience she'd never had before. She had always been able to locate an individual before, but because of Max being in a coma, things seemed to be completely new to her. She was utterly unreachable. However, we still do believe that she may end up waking up and help in defeating Vecna once and for all. For the time being, she may simply be trapped in some kind of purgatory. Eleven As for Eleven, we're definitely going to be seeing her learn more about her powers and get even better at controlling them. Due to her excessive training in the final season, she's more powerful than she's ever been before. Like, come on, she brought Max back to life minutes after her heart had stopped beating. This is another secret that the group does not know about and might be revealed later on in the final season. Last but not least, we also think that Nancy and Jonathan might have their relationship crumble down as the connection between Nancy and Steve never really went away in season 4. However, all of these are mere speculations and can only be confirmed if they're true once Season 5 actually arrives. One thing is for sure though, we're all anxiously waiting for it. Click on one of the two videos on your screen right now, we'll catch you guys in the next one.